Dentists say our seniors are dying from dirty teeth. When a loved one is dealing with complications from old age or dementia, some of their routine daily tasks are sometimes overlooked by the people caring for them. And dental hygiene is one of them. In this special report, News 9's Victoria Saha takes a closer look at the issue. From a young age, it's molded into our brains of how important it is to brush your teeth. However, when we get to the later stages of life, it often gets overlooked. But did you know our senior citizens are dying from dirty teeth? The power of the toothbrush goes a long way. And the importance of a clean mouth is something Ginny Frisbee knows too well. He was not able to take care of his oral health. Her dad was in senior care toward the end of his life. He had a problem with chewing and food would impact the back of his mouth and no one would know about it. She says that stuck on food would go unnoticed for weeks. He wasn't able to swallow and chew and so because he wasn't able to that that food sat back there and it uh, created bacteria and that's what he aspired into his lungs. A scary reality for many other seniors just like Jenny's dad. The bacteria from the mouth is capable of penetrating the blood-brain barrier and recently um, it has been discovered in the brains of Alzheimer patients. If we leave the mouth being um, so dry there's a shift in the type of bacteria that's growing in the mouth. Where their other health needs come before oral health, studies show one in 10 cases of death from pneumonia in elderly nursing homes could be prevented by improving daily oral hygiene. It's not that they don't care. Oral health care just kind of falls by the wayside. But that's where Teresa Cheka comes in. One of the few high-life oral care specialists in Wisconsin, making visits to nursing homes to clean patients' mouths. It is a mission. We know there is a need. We know there is a disease in adult um, care communities. Teresa has helped many families like Jenny's. She gave me an education. When she opened up his mouth, because he had trouble with chewing and swallowing, he had quite an impaction of food way in the back of his throat. And so... Um, she had pulled that out and I was really surprised by the amount that was impacted back there that I had no idea. She says nursing homes aren't to blame. So it's time issue. It's not that they're ignoring it completely. And a Stonecrest nursing home in Wausau says they make it a daily routine. Some people that just have it at, um, have their teeth brushed in the morning and at night. Some people it's after every meal um, due to pocketing. Some people have lost teeth, so they do pocket food more. Ensuring oral health is taken care of. As for Teresa, she knows her work makes a difference. The stuff that we clean out of their mouths um, shouldn't be there in the first place, but it happens because your body is giving up. So that always makes me feel better when I look at the um, the patient and he or she all of a sudden is breathing a little bit better. Knowing a brighter smile can give patients a brighter outlook on life. Families in the Wassa area can reach out to Teresa for her services. She says her mission is to take care of patients by saving every tooth. Her contact information will be up on our website at waow.com. In the Control Center, Victoria Saha, News 9, WAOW.